Weep Nation, what's going on? Shark Gaming here, back with another video. And in today's video, it's another rant. You get me? I'm literally just recording them as they come. I'm just recording another rant. So today's rant, I don't remember what the title is. I don't even know what the title is going to be. But the rant is basically me saying why I hate summers in Jamaica. No, I love Jamaica. Jamaica land we love. But this summer, I don't know if it's just a thing that everybody says every single year. But this summer, Jamaica just feel hot. And don't get me wrong. If I was going to pools and beaches and I had my sunscreen, I really need to buy some sunscreen. Because I've been, I've been like really, really, like the sun been burning me like really, really bad. If I was going to the beach and going out and in AC, because I don't have any AC at my house. I don't know if you guys are fortunate to have AC at your house. Good job. You get me? The only good thing I have going for me is that I live on a mountain. So usually at night time, it's a bit cooler than obviously on the flood. But during the days, fam, I work on a plant. And I'm telling you, the place is already hot. So when you add on the summer sun, it's dangerous, fam. Bro, I am telling you, I am burning up blood. I have used more, like usually... I put five grand gas in the car and it brings me to work from Monday to Friday. Nowadays, I have to put in probably eight grand because man, I am burning AC every single day. There is no way that I have my car and I am driving my car for the what's the word, comfortability that I want out of the car, right? The comfortability that I want out of the car. There's no way I'm driving the car for the comfortability and I'm not burning the AC. And it reached so bad that right now, it's on two. I have four levels. Well, five. If you count zero. Zero, one, two, three, four. So five levels. Fine. Five levels of AC. Right now, I'm literally on level two. And it feels like... Like if you get level two enough time, it will warm up. But you see? I have a little sun visor. Let me show you. I have a little sun visor. The sun visor, this is how it looks. You know one of them um, cheap ass sun visor there? Where you know the people them um at the at, at the at the light the light or the gas station anything they sell you and you ask them you say yo it can fit my car and you know it, it claims it fit and it have the little um let me show you it have the little suction thing is that barely stick on watch it that barely stick onto the glass sometimes it sticks sometimes it doesn't I am I'm, I'm gonna have to buy something off the internet I from I'm gonna buy one of those the umbrella little the umbrella looking one I'm gonna get my tape measure because I have a tape measure I'm gonna measure the dimensions of my windscreen and then I'm gonna try to find one on the internet that fits my dimension and try to find something I can hold it up as well I feel like if I get the one that can I'm open out like this then I can like cover it up on whatever the case may be so that might help during the days because during the days you know the Sun getting a lot of heat what I do I usually crack the window still when you crack the window I guess it allows for the hot air to rise and the cool air to kind of like circulate downwards whatever the case may be but it's still hot fam it is still hot it is blazing hot even luckily i don't have leather seats i don't have an expensive car i don't have expensive seats so i don't have leather seats with this heat if i was supposed to have leather seats i'd be burning my skin every single day that's how bad it is like it's not even a joke like it's actually quite i don't know how to explain it it's actually quite um concerning how hot the place is like I can imagine the people that are taking bus or public transportation, my, my heart goes out to you because I know that like sometimes, especially with the whole squishing up with people and then the temperature and stuff and I, I guess most buses unless maybe it's a JUTC and even then sometimes the AC doesn't work in the JUTC. I know that when you go in most buses, you know what I'm saying, one, you're not that comfortable in it, you're not that comfortable in the taxi either, you're being squished up which makes you know more friction which means you're going to be sweating more plus the place is already hot like i'm telling you it reached the hotness where i can wind down my window and it still feel hot i, I have to be driving like maybe 50 to a 50 or more kilometers per hour to really feel like cool breeze and most of the time if you're in traffic you have to turn on the ac bro because one you have the exhaust from the car coming so you have the exhaust from the car coming that's one the exhaust from the car and then you also have the AC. I mean, and then you also have um, the, the, the the stagnant. So because you're in a stagnant area and it's not windy. Because the place is not windy, that's a problem. You get what I'm trying to say? Bro, I am so fur in. I am suffering, bro. I can give you that. I'm suffering. So luckily, thank God, God has blessed me in a situation where I can buy gas. So I buy gas a lot. You get me? Thank God. Thank Jesus. Praise Jesus. Hallelujah. I love that. You get me? I buy gas every day. Not every day. Oops. 
I buy gas as much as I need to. And I go home on sometimes three, um, I go home on sometimes three gas or the four bar gas. And that's not gas AC, three bar AC or four bar AC. That's just what it is, you get me? When I end this video, I'm literally gonna go in some four bar AC. Like that's literally what I'm going to be doing. You hear me, Trey? Say, like that's 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 what I have to do. Like that's how bad it is. But I'm grateful that I can do that. So it does burn my gas more because one, I use 87, and two, my car has to go up a hill. So big. My thing is that I think my car only has one fan. I could be wrong. It's a Vitz. It only has one fan. So because it only has one fan, I feel like you have my fan that would use, like when you want to generate more power and you need the fan. Because you're using the AC, you have to turn off the AC and withstand the lovely, cool, not cool, hot air outside. outside. Or I can keep on the AC, maybe not max it out at four, put it at two, and just take my little time go up the hill because sometimes I have to go up a hill and when you go up the hill, you know, my car is not really built for power. You know, of them big horsepower there, whatever the case may be, bro. My car just does what it needs to do. That's literally what it is. You get me? I don't know if anybody else is taking like, or is getting this type of treatment because as I say, if I'm at home, I literally like I live with the fan right on my skin, bro. Like the place is extremely hot. I'm telling you that like the place is so hot that I can probably wash clothes right now. And I put the clothes out there for 40 minutes, 30 minutes properly. And most of the clothes are supposed to fully finish dry. Maybe not the towels, maybe not the sheets, but most of my shirt, them because they're thin. Most of my underwear and my shorts and them thing, that maybe not the, 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 the thick shorts, the more the joggers, the more even the jeans pants. Maybe the jeans, them need like a one hour or something like that. Whatever, but I love it when it rains. You see, I prefer, it's funny, I prefer when it rains than when it, I prefer when it rains than when it's hot. And the funny thing is that when it rains at my place, just the liquor trickle, just rain drizzling, then I'm gonna lock off the light. That's how bad it is. Sometimes, if wind starts, you know what I'm saying? They're gonna lock off my light, fam, for a little bit. Because JPS is like that, you get me? JPS is like that. But it's just one of them things they give me a choice, so like, I'd rather that than, in, like, I just hate the weather, bro. The weather is killing me, bro. But at the same time, I love the heat. Like, the heat feel nice. It's pretty, like, honestly, if you live, like, in a snowy area, you'd really, like, grow an appreciation for the, like, the sun. It's just that I'm not fully prepared. So, one, I need to make sure that I get a better visor. I need to crack the windows. And then I, I just need to be prepared to spend more money because I have to use AC, you get me? So, because I have to use AC, I just have to be, a, be prepared to spend more money on gas. But that's fine. Like, it's a necessity, you know what I'm saying? Like, I just need it. I don't know if anybody else can relate to that. That's just what I had. That's like my two cents on the whole situation. You go know right like that's that's really just what it is. You know, like I, it's just it, it like it's just what it is, bro. I rather stay in the AC and have to buy gas twice a week or just buy full up the gas, full up the tank. Or five grand, I go full up my tank. You know what I'm saying? It's just that five grand can carry me for the five days. You know what I'm saying? But I rather full up the tank so I can be able to use the AC because trust me, I need the AC. I need to use the AC, bro. I don't care nobody wants it. I need to use the AC. The AC is like very, 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 very elegant, very mindful, <laughs> very classy. <laughs> I'm not gonna say the other part. If anybody knows the other part, they can say it if you've reached this far. But that's really that for the video. You guys already know how it stay about.